We have been learning about author's purpose. The three reasons an author might write something is to either persuade you, inform you, or entertain you. When they are persuading you, they want you to feel a certain way about a topic. Informing you is giving you information and details to help you learn about something. Whereas entertain is the author writing a story for your enjoyment. I'm going to read this article, Should Kids Have Homework? And we're going to think about what the author's purpose is. We're going to be using this article then to compare our own feelings about homework to the author, Janet Lang. It's a little bit hard to see, so just follow along with me as I read. Homework. Some teachers love assigning it. Some kids love completing it. Some teachers dread grading it. Some kids complain about getting it done. As a parent and a retired teacher, I strongly believe that students should not have homework. So right off the bat, let's think about what is the author's opinion here? The author has a very strong opinion. The author said, I strongly believe that students should not have homework. Think about how you feel. Do you think that kids should have homework? Do you agree or disagree with Janet Lang? Okay, I'm gonna keep reading the next paragraph. To begin with, homework often leads to family arguments. I can recall several times where my two sons would get off the bus, bus in elementary school and I'd ask them to start their homework right away. After much procrastination and complaining, they would begin. If they looked stuck, I would lean over their shoulder and try to help them. Instead of accepting my help, they would both chime in and say, Mom, you don't teach it the same way as Miss Miller does. Insert eye roll emoji. This would then lead to a conflict amongst us until the homework was complete. So right there is some of Mrs. Lang's reasoning for why she does not like homework. She says that it can cause family arguments. She experienced that with her own two sons. Is this something you've experienced before? So she's giving us more evidence to help support her reasoning behind her opinion. I'm gonna continue reading down here at most. Most importantly though, it seems like kids are having more homework, which leaves less time for them to spend doing other activities. Students spend all day in school, and when they come home, I believe they should be able to spend time with their family members, play outside, attend sporting events, or other extracurricular activities. With one to two hours of homework per night, students have less of a chance of finding a passion outside of school. So there is Janet Lang's second point. She says, kids are in school all day long. They don't need to continue school when they go home. Instead, they need time to explore other interests that they might have. Is this something you do after school? Do you like to do other things besides schoolwork after school? We're starting to get a real sense of what Janet Lang's opinion is. She stated it right off the bat. She doesn't think kids should have homework. And she's given us some solid reasons to back up her argument. What do you think so far based on what we read is her purpose for writing this? Is she trying to persuade us to feel some way? Is she informing us by giving us facts and helping us learn on a topic? Or is she trying to entertain us, write something fun for us to read? Think about that question as we keep reading the last paragraph and then we'll talk about it some more. Homework has been around for what feels like the beginning of time. However, it's time to change the way homework is given in school settings. So we can very clearly tell what the author's opinion is. This author, Janet Lang, strongly believes that students should not have homework. Let's talk about her purpose for writing this. Remember pi, persuade, inform, or entertain. Let's start with the P, persuade. Is she trying to get us to feel a certain way about something or agree with her? Absolutely. She's trying to give us information to help us agree with her that students shouldn't have homework. 
she is definitely trying to persuade my opinion to make me feel like homework is not the best for students. So it sounds like this is persuade, but let's go through all the options just to make sure. Also, there's inform. Yes, she's giving us facts, but they're more her opinions. So she's not giving us facts to help us learn about a topic. She's not writing this paper for the sole reason of us to learn about something. The last one is entertain. Is this a fun writing piece that you read just for fun? No, I don't think so either. So the best choice is persuade. Janet Lang has written Should Kids Have Homework to persuade us to make us feel that kids should not have homework. Now, what were some of the reasons that she said? She said, homework leads to arguments. Homework doesn't allow kids to explore other interests. And she says that kids should be trying to find other passions outside of school. We are going to use this information in our live lesson.